welcome to It's, it's Anderson. Anderson. Today we are sharing our three favorite funny, funny laugh out loud <laughs> books with you guys. Hey guys, so we are in the same clothes because we are doing it the same day. We have our three top books that we think are pretty. What, Rabbit? Funny. Funny. They're very funny. Okay, so Taylor is going to introduce our first one, and it's actually an early reader one. Um, okay, Taylor, go ahead, hold it up, and tell them about the book. This is very funny because this family eats in the bathtub. Yeah, it's funny, huh? So it's we eat dinner in the bathtub. We sleep in the Dining room. Dining room. Yes, park in the kitchen. kitchen. Kids love this one. It's what? Funny. It's funny. And will help make your kids what? Laugh. Laugh. This one is Rotten Teeth. And so this is about a girl named Melissa. And she is doesn't want to bring show and tell. She doesn't know what to bring. I, I love this part because she thinks there is nothing, nothing interesting in her house. At her house. Does her house look interesting? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Really. This has beautiful artwork. We love finding books with beautiful pictures mm -hmm. and artwork. Okay, so Melissa. Thinks, I like the elephant mowing the lawn. <laughs> <laughs> burn, burn. She thinks I would there's like nothing that interesting enough to bring to show and tell. Then one day she asks her brother for advice and he says, why not to bring the rotten teeth to class? Why do they have rotten teeth at their house? Because her dad's a dentist. A dentist. Yeah. There's, rotten, there's a bottle of rotten teeth in the hey. back. She takes it to school and she gets in trouble for bringing rotten teeth and trying to give one to each and every single person. Puts one on each of the desks and the teacher does what? Picks it up and puts it in and calls her dad during recess. Yeah, the teacher kind of freaks out <laughs> and the dad shows up. And what I love about this book is... Um, at the end, she brings a zebra. Yeah. <laughs> But I also love that this one is based off of a true story of about a little girl that brought rotten teeth to school from her dad's, yeah, from her dad's, um, he was a dentist and so she brought a jar of rotten teeth. And she said that she learned from this experience that she loved to tell stories and she shared this story in here and we, it's really funny, they love it, huh? They talk about screaming and yelling when you get your teeth removed, but you have had teeth pulled out because to get make room for other ones yell. to grow and you don't scream and yell so I don't read that part because I didn't want my kids to be nervous off. because should they be nervous no did you guys know that was in there no no because no, I skip it so anyways I skip that part but if they hear it they can, you can tell them what it doesn't hurt it doesn't hurt so anyways I didn't I take scream. that part okay so the next book that is really funny is, is to me cops will oh, change his socks, socks. Raise your hand if you like this one. Me, 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 me. Yeah, did you like it? Yes. All of the kids this love this one. So this one is such a funny and cute story. It because is about a boy. A this is a book about a boy named Timothy Cox. And his, he said to his dog, Smithy, what if I don't change my socks for a whole month? And he said, boy, that would stink a lot. And um, then Timothy Cox it for a whole month, and everybody kept saying, Timothy, Timothy Cox, won't you consider please changing your socks? <laughs> it's really cute, huh? Does this one make you guys laugh? Mm-hmm. Yes. Here is a cute picture of his class having to open windows because Timothy Cox's socks stink. Are his friends trying to play with him, but the stink is too much for them. Skunk lives with him because he doesn't mind his smell, but then it gets so bad that even the skunk <laughs> can't stand its smell. That is probably the kid's favorite part. Part of the book is actually how they end it, and it is with <laughs> Timothy Cox telling people that he always follows through on what he does, but now he kind of decides what is worthwhile <laughs> spending that much time in following through and really thinking before he commits to something. These are our three picks. These are our three picks that will make you what? Laugh! Okay, if everyone had to pick just one, which one do you like the most? So Lissa's pick is Rotten Teeth. Taylee's is We Dinner in the Bathtub. Eamon's would be Timothy Socks. And, and Eat Dinner in the Bathtub. And RJ's is Rotten Teeth. They're all having a hard time choosing. They keep switching back and forth. <laughs> so, I 
again, I think the local library would have these three, and you can check right. them out, read them, and see if you like them as much as we do, and then add it to your library. Your library. Yeah, your family library. So if you have any videos where you share your favorite books, we would love to what? Watch them. Yeah, we would love to watch them and check them out. So let us know. Put links below. We love learning other people's favorite books. And if you like it, give us a thumbs up, and make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.